Yo, 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 can you hear me? Can you hear me? Huh? 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 It's go time, and I got my homie with me. Showtime. Huh? Bah, bah. Oh, man, oh, man, here we go again. So, you know. Make sure the audio is working this time. Huh? Oh, no, 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 no. Audio's clear like Claudio. Okay. You heard? Yeah. yeah. Turn me up. Turn me up. Oh, feels good to be back. Huh? Yeah. Where was your antennas while all of this action was going on? Listen, man, I had to work, man. It's Black Friday weekend, dog. You already know what it is. Oh, okay. Sales on top of sales on top of, do you have, we need, and can we have okay, this by okay, this day? Okay, okay. Nah. Well, well uh, dearly beloved, sincerely departed, we're just getting started. I got my guy with me. Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Bah! Yeah, so... King of the Dot Town Business 2 mm -hmm. went down this weekend. Mm -hmm. um, I know you saw the battles, and I figured that what we could possibly do, you know, we can just go through the battles. I've pretty much given a lot of my perspective. You get out of here. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. So we can get to you. You say who you felt like won, and if it's cool, then we do what we done, and, you know, it's done. Well, look here, Vada. Listen, right? you, you and you my man. 150 grand. Fendi. But there was a couple battles. You seemed a little biased. What? You seemed a little biased. I know it's unbiased, but you just seemed a little biased. One, all right? Chilla Jones did not get robbed. No, okay. I'm not gonna lie. I'm no. not gonna hold you. I was on the same boat as you. I was like, yo, Chilla got robbed the first time. I ain't gonna lie. The first time, yes, I had Chilla winning 2 1. This time, mm -hmm. Real Deal actually had a really, really, really good angle. We not gonna do the bars things because you know we already talked. You already talked about it. Mm -hmm. I just want to give my take on a couple of things that I liked about that battle. Okay. Um, for Chilla, Chilla did what he was supposed to do, but when it becomes, I felt as though that when you lose something, you're supposed to have a little bit more tenacity, a little bit more, you know, uh, vigor, vigor in your voice. You get what I'm saying? When you want your chain back. Mm -hmm. To me, it didn't seem like Chilla really wanted his chain back. Mm -hmm. He just wanted the fair fade. Mm -hmm. And that's what he did. But Real Deal, being the champion, he had, he didn't have no chip on his shoulder. He, well, technically he did have a chip on his shoulder because of the fact that, you know, uh, uh, rest in peace to his pop. You know, right after that, he had to go and deal with, the, you know, the, the death of his father. He had to handle that. But all of that scrutiny and all of that stuff, they telling me that I'm a fake champion. I didn't win it the right way. Well, let me show you why I am the champion. Okay. And I think Real Deal really did that. And I think his third round angles... I, I think that is Real Deal's great, greatest attribute of being a King of the Dot champion right now. Mm -hmm. That It's going to be hard to beat him in a third round angle. Mm. That whole thing where he said about Chilla Jones' progression, about his volumes, right. like that, oh, that was crazy. He said, he said, then let alone you're battling Nitty, another King of the Dot uh, uh, original. Alumni, and, baby. And alumni, and now you got, and they got the nerve to put you on volumes. Like, Come on, that that angle alone was fire. Um, I liked how uh, uh, Real Deal, Real Deal to me, he just, I, I think he just had better angles. So I'm gonna just say that I don't think Chilla got robbed. That was one. Yeah. Like I said, I can respect it, mm -hmm. your opinion, but I, I, I just feel how I felt, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Because I felt like he got robbed the first time. Second battle, I felt like he did his thing. That's just my personal opinion. Yeah. But I mean, I, I can go with that. I've already said how I felt. Yeah. Danny Myers first pass. Uh, yeah, that happened. Um, you already talked to him, right? Facts. All right, so so I don't have to say what what already has already been said. Okay. D Danny, I, I I get it. You know what I'm saying? I I, I get it. Mm -hmm. You you battled Thursday night. You mm -hmm. battled Friday night, mm -hmm. and then here you are Saturday night, mm -hmm. and 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 all of a sudden, oh, oh, oh. apparently you got a present. From your good old pal here, Vada said, you get the L. How did you choke the second and the third round? Danny, Danny, and you are the bar god. You are the bar god, okay? Um, I get it. You battled those nights and you, you, you had a lot on your plate and it was up against Paz. But there is a battle that is supposed to happen next mm -hmm. on your plate. Mm -hmm. And this is the 
frame of reference we have to give towards the next battle. Nigga, it's hollow. Talk to him, Sean. It's hollow. Talk to him. Hollow, hollow ain't battled since the uh, the uh, the loaded the loaded hollows. Talk Before to him. that, he 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 took a he took a L himself. Talk to him. Okay, hollow's finna smoke you. Just go. If you about to do. Danny, just go. Danny, just go. I need you to set everything to the side. Just go. I need you to put everything away. Keep going. I need you to put all kid, all of the kids to bed. I need you to tell the wife, hold on, not tonight. Keep going. You don't get none of this tonight. Just go. I have to carefully craft these bars. You know that doomsday package that you had? I need you to at least pull three of them out just for Hollow. Keep going. You need to kill something. Just go. You need to murder something. Keep going. And Hollow was not gonna let you get killed. Don't He's go. not gonna let you kill him. No, no, no. Give him no. what he needs. Give him no. what he needs. Give no. him what he needs. Danny, Danny, no. I get it. You was I, it wasn't. It, they both was on home turf, so it wasn't like. I mean, well, he's from Las Vegas. That's what they'll say, but uh -huh. he's from the West Coast. But either way, it's versus Pass. Pass has been killing shit, but to me, I feel as though that wasn't even the craziest pass that that we've had. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I just don't feel like it. But <clears throat> Pass did exactly what he was supposed to do to win for the home team, and that's exactly what it was. And that was town business. Don't let Danny go. Then this battle just dropped. First, do we know what happened in that? That battle, that battle came out. Yeah, it came out. Ain't that the battle where he died? Yeah. Did so he we choke? Back. Did, yeah. did he? So Every round. yeah. So. Yeah. Danny. So you got two straight battles that dropped. Danny that <laughs> chokes and stumbles. <laughs> and I was supposed to believe. And lest we not forget about that franchise debacle. Just keep going. Let's, Danny. The, okay. the bar god. You oh, okay. seem very human right now. Oh, okay. You seem very human. Oh, okay. You are a bar human. You are a bar mammal, sir. Well, keep talking about that battle as a waste of my mother in time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you cutting into your mother's in time. Um, let's talk about a battle that uh, was good, mm -hmm. did have three full rounds, mm -hmm. and was a complete war. Oops versus B dot. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Well, I'll give my um. Go I'll ahead. just give my quick thoughts on the use. battle. Uh, Oops versus B dot was a fire battle. Mm -hmm. These two, uh, it was B dot's return. We haven't really seen B dot in quite some time, like a mm -hmm. uh, little less than a year. I think the last time, don't quote me, I haven't seen him since J C. Yeah. Yeah, since yeah. you the battle yeah. J C. J C. J C. Cleaned him up. And I haven't seen him since then. Mm -hmm. A lot of people been asking for B-Dot to come back. A lot of people wanted to see him come back. And to see him come back in the style that he did, he was broke. He was wicked. Yes. Oops did his thing in this battle too. Yeah. yeah. But uh, I just feel like with what I wanted to see mm -hmm. was what I saw. But, you know, give me your thought. I mean, it's two different dynamics that you got to look at. And it's two different styles of the flow where uh oops is the slow it's the slow burn but it's worth it every bit of it you know what i'm saying the way that oops raps and then not to mention he's gonna hit you with some good good content the one where the one line where he says uh they said that the, the revolution won't be televised it's gonna be on but thanks to us it's gonna be on youtube oh, you know it's stuff like that but then he had the other one in his first when he said a line like uh Y'all want me to kill a dot? Mm -hmm. Well, it's failed. Mission failed. This is Braille. I want y'all to feel feel dot. dot. You know what I'm saying? That and, was crazy. And and it's it's an unorthodox punchline that he has, and that's what makes oops oops. And and I get that now. You know what I'm saying? At first, I wasn't a big fan of it because I thought it was I thought he was stumbling. No, that's that's mm -hmm. just how he raps. Mm -hmm. And it's another round, a line in the battle. Uh, that caught a lot of people off by surprise. Mm -hmm. He said, "We in Oakland talking about hammers. Mm -hmm. I'm too legit, like too legit, too legit, crazy, mm -hmm. crazy." You got anything else from man? You need what you got. I need what you got. All right, all right, all right, all right. The, the other one that I got from that first round was when he said, "Your son named Malcolm. Mm. My son named King. Mm. This conversation ain't a coincidence." That's oops. That's what you bring to the table, my guy. I, I, I like it. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And I, you know what I'm saying? He jumped on me last time because I said I, did, I didn't like his pin. Just go. And so he stretched his pin this just time. Go, and go. I felt that, my God. I, 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 I rocks with all of it. All right? Mm -hmm. I rocks with all of it. Yeah. But B-Dot had to rap. And when B-Dot raps, 
it's more of a militant, it's, it's, it's an aggressive, he makes you unapologetically black. Like, if Chuck D was a battle rapper, that, that is, that is B-Dot, bro. Like, that is, he makes you feel like, if you ain't about, if you ain't about being a part of this black power movement, Talk to B Dot. He gonna get you on that. See, Lux, Lux will tell, Lux will empower you. They're like, man, we gotta get up, we gotta rise. B Dot, like, nigga, we about to get, up. Get, this now. Yeah, get yeah, your, yeah, put yeah, your yeah. fist up right now. And it's man, that black guy. It's power. black. Oh man, it's your last days. This your last, last hour. hour. Yo, so, he's crawl, man. The, 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 the one I like, the, the one I like from him when he was like, uh, he says you use black trauma. To, he said you use black trauma for big gain. Nick, how precious? How precious. Because. Right. Big, Precious, big, big, black, black, yeah, black trauma for the big game. Uh, uh, then he said, uh, he said, uh, how are you the fourth horseman, but his fifth, but the fifth member? Can yeah. you imagine a Jackson Five with a sixth, sixth member? member? Okay, fact check. I just want to let you know, be that. Um, Jackson Five did have a sixth member. That was when Randy got old enough he could perform with him. They were called the Jacksons. But you, I, I'm with you. I was with you. I'm just, I just, I, I had Talk to him. I, I mean, I just, you wasn't wrong. But the facts was a little off because it wasn't called the Jackson Five; it was just called the Jacksons. Anyway, um, second round, um, I I think I had Oops winning this. I had Oops winning the second round with the more powerful uh, content because I then started to get used to B dot. Um, we not going to tag on, on all of the lines, but I do believe the one that got me more. Uh, the one he says he says on screen I could touch dot while I recap calibrated. Because what happens is, you know, this is Best Buy talk. So what happens is, what happens? Your TV starts to have the little uh, glitches. You can either reset or do a software update, and then nine times out of ten, the pixels repixelate. But if you got bad kids, you might want to call the manufacturer. Anyway, uh, round two was on beat. He had a lot of good, not, nice, nice content. Um, but he says, "Boy, you dropped the ball. That change was faster than chess versus rock." Get it? You you drop change faster than yeah, chess versus yeah, rock. Yeah, to drop the change. Yeah. Anyway, the shell cases. I liked it. You know what I'm saying? But you know, I still gave it to Oops. Third round, it got real. The third round is all personal preference. Mm -hmm. I myself, I had B Dot win in the third round because, and this is no slack. Um, I, uh, uh, suicide is a very very serious thing, uh, and that's and that's something that we can always talk about. There's always somebody you can talk to if you ever feel like you're on the brink of that. And I loved B Dot's angle on. He says, "You almost took a black life." Mm -hmm. And no, I'm not talking about anybody else. I'm talking about yourself. We could have been doing this together. We could have been building. Like I loved that aspect of it. And for that, I gave B Dot the battle. But I do think at the end of that battle, I think they said that they're gonna link up and now they're trying to do a two on two. With that, um, the, like I said, um, Oops had it was the second round. Mm. I couldn't really give him the second because he was like stumbling and choked in his second round. It was it was he choked. He did. He, 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 he did. He did. I liked it, I, but I still. But it was at the end though. He had enough time. But he had stumbled in the middle of the round too. He stumbled in the middle of the round and then he choked at the end of the round. You know what I'm saying? So for me. B dot had the way clearer round, way clearer material. The rounds overall was fire though. Um, B dot, um, oops, third round he took a different angle. I felt like he, he kind of sacrificed his third round. Yeah, he used to he, talk he about shot right at Sharon. Sharon. He used to talk about you know his son being black and talking about him having white friends mm -hmm. and um you know just the the whole. I did like the thing where he's talking about Gully uh, and his son. Yeah, your son he said, can't but be I, friends he said, with my son unless he's willing to take a bullet. Come from on, him. man, that's. That's that's a serious conversation. We got sons, man. Like that's mm -hmm. that's a very serious conversation that a lot of the the other dip or the king of the dot fans don't get to have that conversation. I guess you know what I'm saying. I don't know. I don't know. I I I, I like the uh, Sh uh, Oops did do the shots at Sharon, but he did waste most of that round mm -hmm. towards Sharon. I had beat up. Well, yeah, I beat up when it um two <coughs> one or it could be argued three zero, but two one clear to me. Mm -hmm. Um, another fire battle off this card. Um, A Ward versus Illman. Boy, 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 boy. All right, I, you already you already touched on it. Just go. So, this is the first time I've ever seen A Ward bothered. Mm. Like, like he was like I'm not saying like you know A Ward was gonna punch him or something like that. And they they dapped it up afterwards, but. This did seem like a nice personal grudge match. I know exactly what you mean now when you said there was a lot of tension build up. Because you could tell when they were battling each other, it was 
A1 was doing some dot mod moves. He was talking. He was talking through ill max rounds, and that was not making you look very. That wouldn't make you look good, Ward. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, you know, for that alone, you know, I, I, just on on that, I liked Ill Max. You know, his bars back and forth. He had the uh, the one crazy line. Um, uh, oh my goodness. Who? Uh, about his uh, about the uh, the rap. You a uh, battle rapper, comma, comma Christian. Christian. They <sighs> sent me to hear the comma Christian. Oh, uh, he was wild on him. Like the he comma was... Christian line was crazy. I did like the A word uh, where he did say the most profound or the haymaker of his uh, battle uh, of that battle was um he says you're only famous you're only most famous for being a, a mustard bottle I was like ah I mean it is it, it ain't Ilmac's highest viewed battle but it, it's one of them yeah, it's up there and so <laughs> and I mean and, and that's that's no slack because you know it's very creative I like it I rock with it but. Uh, Ill Mac. I had Ill Mac winning that man. I don't, I don't. I ain't need to get no notes for that one. That one. That one alone. Was, it was personal enough that I think. Ill yeah, Mac I recapped it uh, yesterday. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I I said how I felt. So mm -hmm. I mean, we're gonna keep this going. This is more so. Yeah, but you, way, could, you said that was battle of the card. You said that was battle of the weekend. Right? One of. One of. Okay. One of. Okay. One of. Okay, because we gonna get to my my favorite battle. Uh, Mad Flex versus K. I didn't watch that, and I'm not going to. I did. Um, okay. BK actually did really good. Okay. Moving um, on. It wasn't dirty thirty though. Moving on. Let's, let's keep. Anyway, going. I, I, yeah, I don't. I, whatever. Um, <laughs> RX versus my verse. Oh. Yeah. RX versus my verse. Ladies, 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 give it up for the Latinas. Uh, yes, Telemundo. Yes, all that. Telemundo. A lot of the what a song. Uh, oh my goodness. Had yeah, Mexican versus. Puerto Rican or Dominican. Yeah, Puerto, I, I, Puerto, I, Puerto, I, Puerto Rican, right? I thought so. Oh, either way, either way. I love the content that both of the ladies brought. Mm -hmm. It did show a difference, though. So I want to apologize to my verse because I said that I just didn't think that she had that it factor. She is missing something. But when it comes to the aggression, she was all up. She was all up in it. Mm -hmm. When it came to the flow, she had it. I, I do believe that with my verse raps though it it doesn't it's not like Bonnie where it sounds like she's writing straight off a piece of paper but it's like she wrote it and it was meant for a freestyle or it was meant for a diss or it was the beat in the background you know what I'm saying it, it was it was dope but at the same time uh, my verse had a lot of things that uh, that that showed that she was definitely a better rapper than RX, and I'm gonna say why. Cause she says, "If this is a mirror match, you're only a reflection of me." Fire. Okay. Yeah, she had another battle. It's the only battle of mine you won't watch. So, I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. My verse was doing good, but let's not get it twisted. RX was wild. She was wild. We she both said, got dancing backgrounds, but I learned, learned how, how to hold a beam. Balance the beam. Oh. That was one. The, no, but she had one straight out the gate. She's like, yeah, you got a little bit of body on me. He said, but what's that to somebody who really could put bodies on me? I was like, oh. Telemundo. No, oh, she Tell said I've got the U.S. I got the U.S. on TV. Telemundo. Oh. Wow. One thing I didn't like. I, I'm gonna be honest. Go ahead. I didn't like that my verse. Uh, fucking that part where she was like. You look like Lloyd from Murder. I was like, nah, man. Put that in right. I hated that part. You were both taking parts of the movie. But it didn't even the I was like. Nah, it didn't even rhyme. But what I did rhyme it. So, so she said you look like Lloyd from Murder Inc. <laughs> what? It didn't even rhyme with anything she said, dog. But uh, another thing that I did like in the battle, though, because like I said, like you know, the bars are there, but it's it's all about the the presentation. The <laughs> one, <laughs> the, you know what I'm saying, you know, I did love uh, 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 the uh, uh, the way that my verse was doing the. Uh, uh, Cause I don't know how RX starts the verse, uh, starts it off. She speaks in Spanish. Mm -hmm. It's like some El Rito da puta tarrosos. Mm -hmm. She was like El Rito para todos los She sounded exactly like my Spanish teacher, Miss mm -hmm. Bono. So like, oh my God! It's like you could tell they both teach. They they teach. They learn from their mothers. Spanish. Like I don't know. I was I, I was I was very uh, I was very um I was excited. Mm, I was excited. So you were like, bringing your post of a ninja. <laughs> <I was> like, <laughs> don't do that. Don't, don't, like, don't do that. Uh -uh. Yo, I was like, 
Mm. I was like, no, <laughs> no sir. But um, yeah. uh, how you how you call? Well, I, I had him going one one into the third. Uh huh. Um, and then RX, what? RX, 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 baby girl. Come on, come baby on. Baby girl, Al, 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 Al Free uh. Max B, Al, the wavy uh. man. You th- Al, you third, you third, baby girl, you third, um, you third. Nah, you apologize man. though. No, no, no. See, you don't lose the. All right, I get it. It was some heat, but at the same time, that choke is not necessary. And then when you say, I, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry. It was cool, but nah. In a battle, when we talk about who had complete three rounds, my verse mm-hmm. didn't stumble. No flips, no slips, no nothing. I don't know. Like this, and then like I said, this is a vet. It's one of those battles, I look back at it like the oops battle. If I have it a close battle and somebody chokes, the winner of the battle is going to probably be the person that didn't choke. The my verse and her, I gave my verse the first round. I mean, yeah. I'm, no, I didn't, um, I gave my verse the second round. Second I gave round. Um, RX the first RX round. Had, I like yeah. her material better yes. the first yes. round. First I like how she came out, I like mm-hmm. how she was punching, I yeah. liked her aggression, I liked her cadence, I liked her performance, yes. I liked all of that in the first. Mm-hmm. Second round, uh, my verse had some shit in the second round. Mm-hmm. Now sometimes, her flow do be a little... A little, it'd be a little shaky sometimes yeah. as far as like the because like she'll rap words but like she'll be rapping words but the punches don't really hit that yeah. hard yeah so she'll be saying like complication domination abomination and those words are big words but it don't lead to a big ass punch she's like so, i got a word so big I, that's what I'm, I'm saying it. it's, it's longer than all your last names put together like, i was like <laughs> But it was funny. I mean, it's funny, and the thing is, you know, uh, <laughs> RX did. I mean, my verse didn't choke in her battle at all. I had no stumbles, so a close battle. But uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> it is what it is, man. Yeah. Uh, Frack versus Thesaurus. How you felt about that one? I had Frack winning that one. Frack is just way too lyrical at yeah. this point. Bro. He's way too lyrical. Yeah. Like, he's, Thesaurus. I, I'm not saying he's washed, but. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, he just whatever. doesn't translate well anymore to me. Okay, the day two card. Uh, this is one of my favorite battles of the uh-huh. whole weekend. Mm-hmm. Saint versus B Magic. Did you see my man came out with the fox? He hunted the fox and came out with the mink on. He had the what alpaca. What is this velvet? He had the alpaca. He had some juice. He was about to spill it on there. He had to block that. Sh- no, no. Listen, Saint. Saint is nice. Say it's very nice. Right. Be magic. I seen the remnants of the flow. I'm telling you that the flow be prevailing sometimes. Like, be magic, he he got it. He's in there somewhere. I, I see him. But it, I just feel as though Say was a little bit too much. Just uh I watched this battle twice. It's one of the only battles on the card that I watched twice. Really? Saint was wilding on B Magic all three rounds, honestly. Uh, I tried to find rounds that I could give B Magic, but I would really be forcing myself. Yeah, like Saint, I mean, yeah, Saint won every round. Saint yeah. was wild. Yeah. Like, Saint showed the difference between the old school punches. Like, yeah. B Magic, <laughs> like, what he do is never going to be forgotten. No. Nah. But what Saint was doing to him Unorthodox. was wild. And he said something about the, uh, he said the Rams ain't never get respect till they came to L.A. I was like, oh, my God. He said, That's, he, was, was yo, he was snapping was on him. I like he him. Said, I he, like said, him. he said, he said, he said, it puts you on volumes and smacks. The shit is odd. You want to see basic magic? Just pick a card. Oh, oh. That was like, oh, oh my God. Yo, he was wild on yeah. B-Magic. Uh, yeah, Magic didn't, uh, he didn't deserve that. No. <laughs> um, B-Magic survived. Yeah. He brought three clean rounds. Yes, he did. He didn't choke. No, he didn't. He didn't stumble, mm-hmm. but still. He lost. Guess what? He lost. When you don't do it. <laughs> he lost. <laughs> when you guess what? There's a, you could do all of the things, right? Mm-hmm. Bring clean rounds, mm-hmm. don't stumble, mm-hmm. don't choke. Mm-hmm. That's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. Now, once you get past what you're supposed to do, right. you can still lose. Listen. And B-Magic did everything he was supposed to do, and he still lost. Like, I don't have B-Magic winning at all. Um, hey, look. The Lakers, for some reason, is winning, all right? And I'm yeah, telling you, every night. I'm about to say, and they, and they be, who, who is we just watching? We was going Lakers versus um, New Orleans. Oh man, and they was balling. New Orleans was balling. They hard out. About 15, 20. <laughs> At the oh. end, Mm-mm. come right back. <laughs> He's like, thank you for coming out. Mm-hmm. Thank you for coming. This, this is LA. Yeah. So, anyway. Uh, active versus Briggs Belvin. Briggs Belvin was wicked or active. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. 
about active. I don't want to keep calling him disastrous man. He has come out into his own, but I just feel as though that bricks was just way way too much for him. Uh, yeah, that that doesn't even need to be said. Like he's out wrapped him too much. And why do they keep bringing up jazz? And and they, uh, like I understand if they dated back in the day and now they didn't get it anymore. I, that's fine. I, I get it. I'm pretty sure they both have moved on. Right. I didn't like it. Uh, <laughs> Shotty P versus Verse Live. Uh, Shotty P gotta stop choking, bro. Yeah, he has to stop choking, like bro. And like Reverse Live was he was. I don't know. He's like. I don't want to say Reverse Live is a watered down Pat Stay, but he has a lot of those essences of it. It's like, because it, it, you can't say it's Pat Stay with more bars because I believe as though Pat Stay has way more bars. It, 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 I can see the comparison though. That's just, that's just me. Shotty P, listen, if you lose these battles in King of the Dot against a Reverse Live, you don't belong nowhere else, okay? There, 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 there's plenty of other leagues that will take you and will demolish you. So, Thanks. like, it's, listen, and this is no slack, but Dre Dennis can open them gates and let, let loose any of them right now, and you will be lost in the rush, all right? And, and, and that's just, and that little, I think, I don't know, like it's certain, like you know how certain people you feel like you can just switch them in different mm -hmm. leagues and I think they'll thrive. Um, I knew Rum Diddy was going to be like that, Diddy was going to be right. like that. I think Mike P would be like really, really good on King of the Dot, I'm, and this is no slack. And there was a time where I thought Shotty P was going to be good enough, not good enough to be on on on, uh, on Smack, but that's that's just neither here nor there. I would love to see now A Ward on that side though, That that that's my trade off. Who would go Mike P for Award? I'll trade that. Mm -hmm. uh, Caustic versus Mac Myron. I had Mac Myron 2 1 or 3 0. 3 0. I had him 3 0, honestly. When you say, I want all white people to die, and all the white people in the room cracked up, you won. You, 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 you won the battle. Even though, you know, Caustic made it a bit uncomfortable. It, it was a little uncomfortable. Not racy uncomfortable, but enough to be like, hey. Yeah, uh-uh. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, Mac did what he did. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. Caustic was funny, though. He says, he said, you don't expect it. He said, you sell drugs, right? He said, no. <laughs> no. That's not what you told me in the back? No. no. You sure? All, all right. Cause you, you told me you sold drugs. I was like... <laughs> like chill. That might be the new thing now. Mm. <laughs> like, yeah. I didn't tell you so, Jerome. Let's go with that. So hopefully you ain't <laughs> have to go, go through, through that. that. <laughs> let's go with Rome versus Sharon. That is the battle of the card. Mm, of the card. Of the card. Of the card. Of the card. Just go then. See, I don't really like Sharon like that. Mm. I have a personal vendetta against Sharon because apparently. The uh the the 106 Apart Freestyle Friday champion of that year was uh Sharon. So, 106 Apart Freestyle Friday champion of one year was Sharon, right? Do you remember that year? Of course you don't, but I do. You wanna know why? Because he was a contestant number eleven and I was contestant number ten. There was a time where one in ten, they just put one through ten in the room. I almost had a chance to battle Jerome. And I think I would have smoked him at that time. At that time. Now, it's a little bit different. Everybody knew who he was, and I didn't know who he was at that time. Like I said, I wasn't tapped into the game. I could care less. But needless to say, this was the battle of the card. It was the return of Rome. It was uh, once Rome lost the head ice. You ain't never hear from him again. And it was weird. It was like. Well, he's, had, he's went on to have a pretty, pretty, pretty good career for himself. Yeah. Doing Barstool Media. Uh -huh. like with, with sports media and Barstool, they're one of the bigger podcast companies. And, you know, he's got a huge following, yep. over 100,000 followers mm -hmm. on Twitter. And he's doing his thing. He's pretty well known. He had a little I didn't, special, too. Right. I didn't find out he was with Barstool until like about a week or so ago. I was like. He with them? Yeah, I was, I was like, they're huge. You know what I mean? So that's a huge accomplishment yeah. for him. Mm -hmm. And then to be coming back and battling against Sharon. Obviously, Sharon is wilding now. Wild he's doing now. everything that he's doing. Mm -hmm. So I thought that this would be, I thought in my mind that this would be a mirror match. Yeah. But it really wasn't. It wasn't. Because Roan's pen. 
I'm just going to live and say Rome might have put together some of the best three rounds of material. Three individual rounds of material that we heard all year. It's about time everybody started to notice. Or if, if this isn't the one that a lot of people don't realize Rowan is actually fire, mm -hmm. go back to the Big T battle. That's like one of his highest view battle twos. But Rowan is fire. It's, he is literally the, 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 I, I don't want to say it, but he, there was a reason why he was a king of the dot champ. Him, Pat Stay, they have a different aura about them mm. where it's like they can go anywhere and they, and they will resonate. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Roan is, a, a, he's your English teacher if he can rap. He's real deal. Damn, that's another person. So yeah, past day, Roan, real deal. They can go anywhere and, and they can pretty much like they, they can they can relate to anything. Mm -hmm. And it's the the way that they articulate the bars. And it's not a lot of the metaphysical lyrical with it. He can do that. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. Like like first of all, round one, I, I had Rome winning, clearly. Uh uh second round I had Sharon winning because I feel as though that um uh, uh Rome was becoming more of a one trick pony, but I was I was listening. Um, like, oh my god, I, the reason why I had to battle with the car, because I had, I had wrote it down, I had, I had wrote a couple down. Okay. You know what I'm saying, uh, Sharon, uh, said your grandma's favorite, uh, he's, I'm gonna get your grandma a favorite round, where there's original. Yeah, Hilarious. Man, you know what I'm saying, because you know, the yeah. come on, like, Rome says shit, like, stuff like, like, uh, you was on the sack for years, Vladi Divac. Mm. It was also because they was in Oakland too. Like it makes a lot of sense. He says, um, he said I'm about to get under your skin like an appendectomy or a Patrick Beverly. Oh, uh, because appendectomy gets under your skin and Patrick Beverly. Patrick Beverly is the reason why Russell Westbrook was not 100 percent of full season. Never mind. He says you misunderstood your girlfriend's Tinder bio when she said she wanted you to be challenged mentally. Come on, man. This Come on. The, the pin that Roan has versus Sharon. And it's and he breaks it down. He shang sung Sharon. He says, You're that you're the same you you do you steal stuff from other people. Not saying that he steals it, but he he, he uh he culturally appropriates it with Sharon. I makes it oops ain't wrong in that line, you know what I'm saying, with mm -hmm. Sharon's. I can nitpick a lot about Sharon. But what Jims did was he also promoted that Sharon has autism. Like, mm -hmm. like he's autistic. So these are things that we should be, you know, really, really excited about is the fact that somebody who does have special needs, but he can do this at this level. So there's a reason why somebody with autism made it to 106 and Parker was the Freestyle Friday champion. He could mm -hmm. rap on beat, he was relevant, he could freestyle all those times. And it was amazing. I am proud of Sharon for everything that he has done. But Rome flipped it again and was like, he said, like, wait, he's like, he's like, you can, he said, uh, because of the fact that you uh, can't keep your mind still is why you're so good with the freeze. He says, uh, he says that coming up with rock patterns is how you make it come up with ease. He says, so it seems like all of these attributes, the real person who's at disadvantage is me. me. Do you know how hard it is to be a battle rapper with out autism, bro. <laughs> how can you take? How can you suck the air out of the room? You do that. He was like, make something that everybody can make somebody feel bad about. It was like, all right, well that's that's cool. I feel bad for him. But do you know? Listen, I I I do regular stuff. Do you know how hard it is to wake up and go to work every day and come home to a woman who's gonna nag you to death, who has a child. That's gonna that, that always wants to play with you. Right. These are real facts. This is stuff that we go through on a daily basis. But yet we supposed to applaud you because you, you did your coloring in the lines this today. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I'm just I'm nitpicking, but really that that I, I liked it. it. It normalized the the over set the uh, the over cultural appropriation in today. You get what I'm saying? Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like he, Ron is speaking for people that ain't really speaking. So, I, I don't know. I had Rome winning. Welcome back, Rome. I want to see more of you. But at the same time, if you're still getting more money over what you're doing right now, that was good. Yeah, I had Rome winning, but um, it was a closer battle than people probably gave credit for. I had him winning a 2 1 battle. Uh, mm -hmm. Sharon brought fire material. Yeah. He had dope rounds. It was the best Sharon. It was the best Sharon. Let's not get that twisted, too. That was the best Sharon. 
But I felt like Roan, um, in this battle, he, he just showed that there's levels. I seen a tweet where Hollow the Don was like, he started writing for it, one of his upcoming battles with Danny in the car, like after he heard this battle, like, I gotta get in my A game. Like, he inspired me to write. Mm. So you know you fire when you inspire other writers to get on their A game, because oh, yeah. they like, yo, this man just had one of the better performances of the year. Mm. Now, um, uh-huh. Uh, mm. I don't know if this battle has ended yet. It did. Um, it's still going on. Shh. Yeah, it's still going on. It's still going on. It's still going on right now. Oh, oh shit. Uh, disaster versus Soul Con? <laughs> I'm going to let you uh, have Disaster versus Soul Con. Um, what's your thoughts? How do you feel? I just said all that I could say. Uh -huh. So I'm going to go ahead and get up out of the way. All right. So I'm out of the way. All the way out of the way. Vada said. You got it. He said. I waited until a certain time and I went to bed. Well, do you know what happened when I got home from work? I watched the battle. I got to see Sharon versus Rome. And then I was like, you know what? I'm going to stick around. Might as well watch the main event. Two hours later. Anyway, I actually stayed up. And I actually watched the battle. And I... Don't necessarily agree with everything that Vada was saying. I think Soul Khan had some heat in there. I do believe that. Condense it down a lot. Uh, a lot. You gotta, like, that battle should not have been one hour and, and 40, 40 something minutes. Were you going for the record of the longest battle? Because you did it. Were you going for the worst battle? Ever, cause you did it. Um, disaster. You you didn't have to go. I understand Mook did twenty minutes of rapping, but that doesn't mean or give you the right to do thirty minutes of material. And yes, I know you have your history with DNA, with the unlimited third round, and God only knows that that battle's two hours long. You got a lot of battles where you, you, you're just going a little too long, okay? So, Soul Khan doesn't catch the L for this one. Disaster, you get the L for this one. I'm gonna give two separate L's, okay? The one L is for Disaster and the long ass first round. Bow, that's for that. Second round, you kept it pretty short. It was 11 rounds. It was 11 minutes. I can't get mad at that. But for the 30 minutes, 30, I'm watching this battle. And we're talking about socialism. We're talking about sexuality. We're talking about the usage of the B word. I was finding out how I could do my taxes. I also learned a couple things that I can take off on my credit report. There's some accident. I could have filed all of my W-2 forms watching this battle, okay? This battle, I will never watch again. And it will be too soon. But the second round, Soul Con, I keep the little, keep the flow in there. I like that. And this ripped up the file. And that's why Soul Con was going into his phone. I want to defend that. I do want y'all to understand that I was, because I was watching this at 2 o'clock in the morning mm -hmm. so i ain't got nothing else to do everybody sleep i ain't, I, t I told i told i said hey i'll be right up i'll be going to bed soon this bed is the main event <laughs> two hours later she thinks i'm creeping she <laughs> she like obviously she thinks i went out that night you know what i'm saying and, and the only thing she did was only thing i did was waste my time watching that battle now for that Salute to the subscribers and the notification gang. We appreciate you for watching this long ass video. But at least this recap of the whole event was shorter than that goddamn battle. And I'm gone.